Metro Detroit sets a record. Why today is one of the warmest February days recorded. It was just beautiful out there. Such a beautiful day. It tops our news tonight. I was driving with the windows down. It doesn't feel like February. It's crazy. Right now, Andrew's at the Weather Center tracking our forecast in a minute. He's going to let us know if this warm streak will continue. But first, your Mont Terry is out at Belle Isle Park with a look at how Metro Detroiters are enjoying the unexpected warmth. Jermont, are people living it up out there? Prayer people are truly living it up. It's something about when the weather warms up, it allows people to come outside, they walk around with smiles. And here at Belle Isle, you can see people just taking pictures, enjoying what they can't believe is still a winter day. The large crowds at Detroit's Riverwalk resembles a scene we find in July. And those out enjoying this record breaker day don't mind. It's a beautiful day and it's so good. Nice to see all people out gathered together and having a great time. When Mother Nature grants us a warm day in February and it happens on the weekend, it's safe to say outdoor activities are a must. Whether it's pedaling with a bar or biking for some R&R, &R, it's safe to say people planned ahead for this weekend weather breaker. I was planning for this like since yesterday. Yeah, I was watching the weather and uh, I was the bike was ready since yesterday. I woke up this morning. I left home like around 10 and it's been like uh, four hours. And you know, anytime there's a chance to hit the iron, diehard golfers will do just that. At Sylvan Glen Golf Course in Troy, it's been months since many hit the green. I was out here just before uh, Thanksgiving and yeah, got a quick nine in that day. But uh, yeah, this is uh, unbelievable. Should be skiing out here, you know. But who's thinking of snow on this day? Eh, kind of. I do miss making snowmans. Leave it to nine-year-old Michaela. She was out taking a stroll with her grandmother. She can't recall the last time she didn't need a coat in February. But I think she sums up our day best. I'm just really hot today. <laughs> I'm not. Yes, it was a little hot out here today. Of course, she's only nine. She doesn't remember the last time she didn't need a jacket because, of course, we set a record today. But the big question, will we set another record tomorrow? Andrew, please tell me that we can. We love this weather, man. Oh, you, you and me alike, you're absolutely right. And that little girl right there said it best. Absolutely wonderful conditions out there today. And for tomorrow, getting closer to record territory once again. Let's review. Today was already a record breaker. We smashed it. The old record, 62 degrees, set back in 1976. Look at the top of your screen. We made it to 69 today. So far, we're looking at temperatures that are still in the 60s. A brand new record for today, for tomorrow. That's a record that was in the 1800s, 1884 of 64 degrees. We'll get close to that tomorrow. And on Monday, the record of 61 set back in 1930.